A CDN needs to know which is the best server to deliver content to different users. A function called request routing. There are two ways of doing this, using DNS or HTTP. When a client requests content, it receives the content's URL. The client then asks a DNS server for the destination of this URL, that is, which server the request should be routed to. With DNS-based request routing, the DNS server replies with a list of IP addresses of servers with the closest to the client first on the list. If the server has the requested content and is available, then the content streamed to the client device. If the server doesn't have the requested content or isn't available, the request is repeated to the next server on the list. DNS routing uses IP level information and was initially built for web surfing, not for streaming video. It may route to a server that's not working or is missing the content. Assets can't be stored in a hierarchy of caches, so cache memory isn't used efficiently. And it's hard to enforce policies that guarantee only authorised viewers can access the content. HTTP-based request routing works a little differently. HTTP-based decisions are made using a request router. A request router, like Edgeware's TV Director, works on content level information so it can use a wider set of routing criteria. It knows which server has which content and whether that server is available. It can also enforce policies and redirect requests based on more detailed information such as client type, asset names, type of content and so on. Requests are sent to the best server delivering a glitch-free viewing experience. And additional features such as Edgeware's predictive load balancing enable smooth onboarding for huge numbers of viewers at live events. You can scale with hierarchical cache layers which optimise how you cache content over different servers and save backhaul network capacity. With HTTP-based request routing, your TV servers can store different content from one another, which is more efficient. And the content streamed to the client from the TV server that best fulfills the criteria set in the policy. So, DNS-based request routing is great for web surfing and can work well for small-scale video streaming or if your content's not that critical. But all of our customers have built their TV CDNs using HTTP-based request routing so they can deliver a scalable and glitch-free viewing experience.